The word monomer can be broken down to mono meaning one and mer meaning molecular parts. The monomers in addition polymerization will always have a carbon to carbon double bond. The word polymer can be broken down to poly meaning many and mer meaning molecules or parts. This is where we join many monomer units together to form one long polymer chain. The polymer will have carbon to carbon single bonds and we will have to put a square bracket around this as we we're just showing a small section of the polymer chain. So there are a set of rules to be able to successfully do an addition polymerization. Step number one, we want to put the monomer into the H shape. Two, draw three monomer units side by side. Three, break all of the carbon to carbon double bonds to form single bonds. And remember, we need to make sure that the arms are out. Four, pop in a square bracket. And five, we put the word poly in front of the monomer name. Step number one, put the monomer into the H shape. The monomer that we are going to use is ethene. So we're going to draw one of these and pop it into the correct shape. Step number two is to draw three of the monomer units side by side. Step number three is to break all of the carbon to carbon bonds to form single bonds. We need to make sure that the arms are out. Now to name this polymer, we just put the word poly in front of the monomer name. So if the monomer is ethene, the name of the polymer is polyethene. So here are some examples for you to have a go at. Remember, you have to change the monomer unit into the H shape before drawing your polymer chain and naming your monomer. So if you want to pause the video and have a go, when you're ready, I will pop up the correct answers. Paper questions from the National 5 2019 written 5b part 3. Propene is an alkene that can take part in a range of addition reactions. Name the polymer formed in reaction Z. Well if the name of the monomer is propene, the name of the polymer must be polypropene. This past paper questions from the National 5 2017 written 13b part 2. Ethine can undergo polymerization to form polyethine. Name the type of polymerization taking place when ethine is converted to polyethine. Now the name of the monomer is ethine, the polymer is polyethine, and we know if it has carbon to carbon double bonds, or in this case carbon to carbon triple bonds, they will undergo addition polymerization. This past paper question is from the National 5, 2018, written 2B, Part 1. The retractable roof on Centre Court at Wimbledon Tennis Club is made from the polymer polytetrafluoroethene, PTFE. The monomer used to produce PTFE has the following structure. Name the type of polymerization used to produce PTFE. We can see in the structure as a carbon to carbon double bond and alkenes undergo addition polymerization. Part two to the 2018 past paper asks us to draw a section of polytetrafluoroethene showing three monomer units joined together. So we can see that they're already providing that in the H shape. So if we draw three of the tetrafluoroethene molecules, we then need to break the carbon to carbon double bonds to form carbon to carbon single bonds and we need to draw arms to connect them making sure the arms are opened at the end and pop around a square bracket. Mm -hmm. 